Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Today I am going to show you how to get mods on Total Miner PC. Alright, so first, what you gotta do is you gotta go to Total Miner Forums. You're, you should be here. Oh yeah, I forgot I was changing my name. Uh, so you gotta go to Downloads and pick a mod. And today we are going to pick... The GK's mod, I assume. Ah, uh, here we'll pick another one of his mods. His mods are pretty good. Uh, we'll pick his. I've actually tried most of these, so uh, I'm gonna pick his Toy Army Men because I actually haven't. Ooh, yeah, I saw this form post. What? Four? Nah, we gotta rate this a five. This boy deserves a lot. But the amount this guy posts, honestly, he deserves so much. All right, so and then you just wanna. Put this to your desktop. <coughs> All right, sorry guys, I'm sick again. I've been sick in every single video I've made so far, which is pretty bad. And you should have this right here. And so now all you gotta do is you gotta create new folder and just, uh, actually no, I think you could just extract files. Uh, desktop, just pick. Okay, and then now it should all be in here. Which I could have just picked the desktop and then I wouldn't have to do that. So, yeah. Alright, so now that we did that, we have it in a file now. Right here. That's not a dot zip or dot rar. Most do it in dot rar. They should do it in dot zip. But, alright. So, now what we got to do is we got to go to mods, and this is where it gets confusing. If you've never done a mod before, all you gotta do is click new folder and then just name it mods. But I already done it, so yeah. Then all you gotta do is drag it in there. And then you should have it. Make a chat. Alright, so that is how you install basic mods. Now we're gonna get into the complex mods. So you come back to the forums, the complex mods would be like <coughs> Uh, I believe the dice mod is a complex one. I'm pretty sure the dice mod is a complex one. So we gotta save as, and then we'll put it in the desktop. And then we have to drag, if I could find it, uh, Here's the dice mod, we can go ahead and delete that. And then we gotta extract here. And then there we go, now we got that. All right, so this one's a little bit different. Due to it being a special mod and it having a DLL, all you have to do is go into properties and then go into here and click unblock and then click apply. And then after you do that, you could do the same thing you did before and simply throw it into your mods and then there you go that's how you get that one to work uh, and the only reason is because Windows 10 is like protective for you and uh, it doesn't want your PC to die so yeah that is how you put mods in someone did request this video so I hope you watched it and I hope it taught you something and thanks for watching click that subscribe button below leave a like and comment and bye